welcome back to my channel so my name is karen my channel is all about fashion mostly bags and shoes and um lifestyle and just random vlogs here if you guys are into this type of video please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to my channel and also please don't forget to hit that notification bell as well so you guys will get notified every time i post new videos so let's get started so for today's video is I'm going to show you another bag and I'm going to show you as well what's inside my bag because I know some of you guys are kind of nosy what's inside my bag especially if I am carrying um, this size of bag. So with no further ado, the bag that I'm going to share to you today is this beautiful bag right here. So this is um, an Hermes Birkin 30 and this one is Barania leather and the color of this one is a fold color and I got this one in gold hardware so it kind of this one pretty much almost similar to the Togo leather but they're kind of slight difference this one um hold on it's kind of heavy uh, this one is um made of the Barania smooth leather not the Faubourg because Faubourg I think that one is like um the upgraded um version of this leather as you guys can see in here this one is really smooth it doesn't have the grain and everything so i put this um little twilly in here just to kind of match this bag right here and this is what the bag looked like it does have that contrasting um white color stitching so what I have inside my bag is first of all is I am going to show you of course I got my water bottle um, if you guys know I do have uh, two kids with me they're at the age of three and five so water is a must in my bag so the next one that I'm going to show you is this of course their tablet I always have this one in my bag and the other one that I'm going to show you is I do have my Gucci sunglasses as well. I really, really love this case because um, I'm not sure if I mentioned this before. Is once I use this glasses right here, this one doesn't up, doesn't take too much space because this one you can actually kind of fold it like this and then hold up. It's just like kind of look like a small wallet, and this is what I love about this um, Gucci case right here and then the next item that I'm going to show you is of course the car keys right here I always do have the line yards it's because sometimes whenever I'm just wearing casual or I'm just carrying my like I'm how do you say this it's like I'm just gonna drop something off as I always just carry my um, car key so I just put it around my neck so it won't get lost or just gonna put it inside my pocket the next one that I'm going to show you of course if we have water we do have some snacks so I do have my Hello Kitty crackers right here that's for my kids um, I also have wipes and this is a moss in my inside my bag because um, if you have kids um, kids will always get dirty every time so um, a baby wipes inside your bag is a must have so you can wipe their hands right away especially if they're eating and then the next item that I'm going to show you is this beautiful um, earbuds slash um, phone charger as well I did a review on this one I got this one in, in Amazon just in case you guys are interested I put this as well at my Amazon storefront and the next item that I'm going to show you is, of course, my Hermes wallet. Um, I had this wallet for a while now, and I've been just using one wallet. But if I carry a um, smaller bag, I kind of change it to my um, YSL card holder or the Accordion Victoria Secret um, wallet. So the next item that I'm going to show you is this one as well. So this is the Nolita 15 from Coach. I got this one from Coach Athlete. So pretty much this bag is like my carry-all bag. 
so this is what it looks like in here i've shown this a couple of times on this video already um i do have my rosaries right here my lip balm my lotion my um feminine thingy i do have some bandits as well and i do have this um uh the toilet seat cover so this is a must in here and i do also have my mirror right here so this one it's this mirror is with with me for i would say um almost two decades now i would say because i got this one when i was in hong kong way back when i was in college and still i have this one and the next one that i'm going to show you pretty much this is it um the next item that i'm going to show you of course this little red envelope right here you guys have seen this um, a couple of times already in some of my videos and then another thing that i have in here is of course my sunscreen so this one is a bello sunscreen so i got this one when I was in the Philippines and I've been using this a lot and I really really like it so Bello is a brand in Philippines so here it is and then the next item that I'm going to show you is this um, nail polish right here so I'm using this OPI nail polish in bubble bath so this is what um, it looks like so i put this inside my bag because just in case i do get some chips on my fingernails i do uh, use this one and before i don't actually use um i barely use um nail polish on my fingers because i always get um chips like this one right here but so i prefer having the the natural or the neutral color so at least if it gets chip it doesn't really show that bad I like if you're wearing red colors and all that and then the next thing that i have in here is this um organizer right here this one i got this one from amazon this is also in my amazon storefront i really really like this one because it's so soft and silky and it has a lot of um compartment and i got this one in contrasting color because it's so much easier to look for your item especially um if your organizer is in contrasting color before i don't actually use organizers on my bags and then as soon as i learn that um okay so i just have to turn off the alarm so um before i don't use um inserts or organizer in my bag but as soon as i learn that um if you um if you take your bag to the Hermes spa is they don't actually um, clean the inside of your bag just the outside so inserts are highly recommended especially if you have one of this um expensive bag and i really really love this bag i really got this one for a really good price um i love how it already patinas and as you guys can see in here is it doesn't have the like the foil stamping that you usually see like um this one it's just like this right here pretty much it's very subtle because you don't actually see the word um hermes made in paris right here i mean made in france so it's really really super subtle it doesn't show up in there i still do have the sticker on this one um i haven't took it out yet um because i'm just as much as possible is i'm trying not to um just kind of leave it down for there so what i noticed with barania leather is this one really um it's 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 scratch like um once you scratch this one it's really gonna show up i'm just gonna show you some samples in here hopefully the camera will pick it up um it is now. as you guys right here 
as you guys see the line right here that looks like a triangle um that is one of the scratches i do have some scratches all over the bag but um but i really really love this bag because uh you guys can see how much um this bag is well loved um another good thing about this bag is also um it really absorbs water well on this one so from what i heard as well as um before since this is one of the heritage letters so when hermes was um just solely for the equest equip equestrian what i'm just gonna put it here because i'm mumbling right now um so this is one of the letters that they use for their saddle bags so this one is really really nice letter and i'm so happy that i got one in my collection and just like I mentioned this is my first birkin 30 and this one has um feet as well so for this one since as you guys know i i have tons of inspired bags in here i just took some of um those feet protector from there and then just kind of transferring here it's kind of tight because this one is not really for this one but anyway, I just put it right here because I'm trying to protect the feet. And then I'm just going to leave it alone uh, until it um, falls off. So that should be it for today, guys. Thank you guys again for watching. And I'll see you guys again next time. Bye.